and now it's really, oh, I love that. I love that too. The term boss chic means to me that someone lives in their own skin and in their own way. Owning your power as a woman. Yeah, perfect. Translating that strength and conviction into what you wear with no apologies. say you know you're a boss chic when you can make your passion into a paycheck which yes, is exactly what yes. you're doing right now and you and you Pooja and I've been thinking about this for almost a year now you know we've been very fortunate to come across some very inspiring women they are breaking glass ceilings and really going above and beyond what the normal culture um, expects us to do so we're just proud to work with them. We're so inspired by them. I like the mouth a little open like you just did. We are both very busy people, just like many of you are. Uh, we have full-time jobs, we have families, we have kids, and it's hard, you know, but we, um, we really believe in Holy Chic and why we first set out to do this, and it's the passion that drives us every day, and I think that's pretty boss. Well. It doesn't feel like work. You know, we definitely hope that other women are inspired by that and could be their own boss chic. I learned over years to just really trust my intuition. When I do, it always serves me. When I think about every move that I made that worked was when I found the white space in any industry. So it doesn't matter what industry you're in, if you're in fashion or if you're in beauty or you're, whatever you're in, find the space that nobody else is in and, and go and own it before anybody else does. Um, I feel, I feel spoiled. <laughs> yeah, I feel like you can be a boss, but you can still be a lady, and you can still embrace your femininity, and I will never compromise that. Holy Chic represents and embodies, to me, the modern-day inner girl that's looking to be comfortable, chic, and also effortlessly classic. As a mom to two small children, I am super busy, and I'm constantly running around, and I need my clothes to reflect that. Work-wise, I'm a host, so I hosted a digital show for Oprah for three years. I also started my own hair and makeup business, so I do a lot of beauty and lifestyle expert stuff. So Bashi for me is just being able to wear a lot of different hats and then being able to parlay the success in each to reflect the other. I'm really proud to be part of a show called Code Black on CBS. I also did a Netflix series called Brown Nation. I knew what I wanted to do when I was a little girl, which was to become an actress, but instead I became an engineer, which I'm really happy I did. And later on in life, I decided I wanted to revisit that childhood dream, and I took my first acting class. <laughs> got boss sheets on my arm right now. confident and beautiful in my holy chic outfit today. They're sexy, they're one of a kind, and they make me really feel special. I have been a dancer my entire life, and one day I was sitting at my desk, I was looking for a ballet class to take online, and I realized in that moment how difficult it was to find classes in your area, and that was my aha moment. Perfect to build a website that would help people stay connected to their passions and hobbies. The term boss chic means to me that someone lives in their own skin and in their own way. Most of my style is about being comfortable. I love movement. Thanks for making 411 girls be able to model. <laughs> so I like things that move with me, that are graceful. Um, I think, you know, both Mega and Pooja are ultimate boss chic women and they are amazing entrepreneurs and I'm so supportive of South Asian females going out there and living their dream and I see that in them and they have a hustle and a passion to them that's really unique and I love their product. Find your passion and live it and really figure out a way to make all parts of your life feel balanced and connected because success is really about making sure that you're feeling fulfilled. So